Good evening, uh, Miss. Good evening, Jancy. How are you? I am fine, thank you. Thank you for being punctual today. Okay. You are always punctual, right? Mm. <laughs> you are the only one, and and congratulations for you for being punctual. Mm. So, how was your weekend? Good. Uh, I'm working. Oh, okay. You were working. Yeah. Okay. And right now it's raining in your house. No. Uh, no. No raining. No. That's interesting. So you worked on weekend. Yes. Okay. So. That is bad because you didn't rest. And no, uh, one store uh, clothes in the beach. Mm -hmm. uh, um, artesanía. Handcraft? Make handcraft? Mm -hmm. Handcraft, yeah. Okay. Wow. You, you, um, you worked today? Yes. Uh, the A in the morning, mm -hmm. uh, uh, seven o'clock. Today? Yeah. Wow. That is a long day. And, and you and you make the handcraft. Yeah. Uh, you make the handcraft on Saturdays and Sundays. Yes. Ah. Okay. Very good. Uh, uh, Saturday and Sunday. Eight in the morning. Uh, a veces. Uh, ¿cómo se Sometimes. Sometimes uh, 11 or 12. Ah, okay, very good. Very good, Ana Yancy. Good to know that. Hello, guys. Hello. How are you? Sunny. Carmen, hello. Good evening, teacher. How are you? was waiting for you and happy to see you again. Thank you, Pitch. Thank, thank you, teacher. And uh, this was a very business day from Friday to, to yesterday. Oh, so are you tired today, no? Yes, because my, my boss was on vacation, so I covered the, the, the time sheets for him and I have a new worker with my in my team, so was very 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 business day. Oh, Early. sorry to yes. hear that. Sorry to hear yes. that. Yes, but we have work and job, so we have ah. to thank God. Yes. Yes, that's right. That's right. Edwin, how are you? Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Are you ready to start? Yes, teacher. Ready. <laughs> okay. Always ready. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So uh, let's see. Tell me, guys, did you do the homework, the quizzes? Good evening, teacher. Yes. Yes, teacher. Okay. Yes, teacher. We can do it. Okay. Because I need to pass the report. I need to pass the report to Inglés Corporativo. That's why I'm asking you to complete these homeworks. Okay? So if you yeah. haven't finished... If you haven't finished the homeworks, please make sure that you finish uh, during this week or before. Otherwise, you are going to have a lot of work to do, okay? So we are about to start right now, and I'm going to call your names. Just say present in case that you are here. I guess that because of the rain, many people aren't 
are in their houses right now or is it only here that it's raining? Is it raining there? No teacher, no. not in my house, no. No, okay. In my, in my house, house, yes teacher. Okay, yes. Raining right now. Okay. In my house, it's raining. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I thought that some people uh, weren't able to come today, maybe because of the rain, but I see that in some places it isn't raining. All right, uh, let's start. Alfonso Antonio, not here. Ana Yancy. Carmen Lisset. Present. Cesar Heriberto. Present teacher. Eh, Claudia Lorena. Present teacher. Danis. Present. Daisy. Dolores. Eduardo. Edwin Daniel. Present teacher. Fidel, not here. Eh, Flor de María. Karina Elizabeth. Present. Oh, you are there. I, di I, I didn't recognize you, Karina. You look different today. <laughs> <laughs> Did you take a shower? <laughs> no? No. <laughs> the, the light. Ah, the it's light. Cool. Okay. <laughs> I see you different tonight. Eh, Lourdes. Yes, I'm here, teacher. Luis Armando, not here. Nelson, Oscar, and Susana. Susana was here. Okay. Thank you, guys. Thank you for being punctual. We are going to start now. Uh, let's see. This is what we have for today, guys. Uh, the topic is how to use there is and there are. That is going to be the main topic for today. Have you heard about this before? Yeah. Okay, more or less? No. No. no? No. Okay, so, so tonight, it's the night when you learn new things about there is and there are. This topic is not so difficult. It's easy, but you need to pay attention in order to uh, understand completely. Let me see. Uh, before we start, we have an activity. Two truth and one lie. Uh, let's see, Carmen, can you help me reading the instructions, please? Yes, okay. Instruction. All class activity. The teacher says truth and lies about the topic over last week. Students identify which are true and which are false. Okay. So that is the main goal for tonight, before we start. Uh, I just want to check if you are uh, understanding the topics. So you are going to remember the previous knowledge about the topics from the week number one. And let's see, do you remember the topics for week number one? That is the question, right? Uh, right now, I'm going to say um, two truths and one lie. You are going to tell me uh, whether it is, if it is true, false, or what, okay? So listen to the first one. Uh, in the last class, we, we checked three topics. Uh, what closes, infinitives, and words to make steps in progress. Mm -hmm. Can you identify which ones are truth and which ones uh, are a lie? I said, what closes, infinitives, and words to mark steps in progress. 
Second is false. The second, which one is yeah. the second? What close? No? No, infinite. Infinities. Infinity. Do you agree, guys? Do you agree with Edwin? Mm -hmm. Yes, Danis? Mm -hmm. I don't remember this. <laughs> you not, you don't remember. Okay. No. <laughs> yes, you are right, Edwin. That is the false infinitives. We haven't covered that topic yet. All right. Listen to the other one. What clauses are used at the beginning of the sentence? What clauses uh, don't have subjects? And what clauses are negative? Which one is true and which one is a lie? I repeat, what clauses are used at the beginning? Uh, what clauses don't have subjects? And what clauses are negative? What mm -hmm. closes are negative is false. Exactly. That's right. That's right. They aren't negative. They are all positive or affirmative. Thank you. Uh, the next one is the words to mark steps in progress are useful to show steps. Words to mark steps in progress aren't important. And the other one, uh, words to mark steps in progress are uh, short words. That is true. Okay, which one is true and which one is false? There is one false there. There is one lie. The first is true, the second, it's false. Yes, that's right. The second is false because the, the the words to mark steps in progress are important. Okay, so thank you very much. Do you remember any other thing that we have covered during the week, the last week, another topic or something? New vocabulary, new words that you learned? For example, who can tell me what is an inventory? Mm -hmm. Who can tell me in your own words what it's an inventory? Mm -hmm. Only one, only one, not many, only one. <laughs> Can you repeat the question, teacher, please? Okay. Uh, tell me in your own words, what's an inventory? What is an inventory? Mm. Uh, the inventory is is the product uh, is it the quantify of the product in in an enterprise or in okay. a company okay thank you thank you so this is it guys basically about the previous week and today we start the week number two and remember that as i was mentioning at the beginning you need to finish the assignments before friday because on friday you will have your midterm exam so make sure that you finish all the activities uh, for not having troubles at the end. All right, so right now we are going to uh, speak a little bit and well, this conversation. Uh, who can describe the picture? 
who can describe the picture? Ah, uh, guys, it's Monday, right? They have a presentation. Uh huh. They are having a presentation. Okay. What else? Where are they? In what place are they? In a food court or restaurant. Okay. Do you consider that they are friends or it's just a relationship between boss and employee? Maybe they are friends or maybe they are a co-worker. Okay, thank you very much. So, boss uh, uh, and Okay, maybe, maybe. We yes. are going to... Uh -huh. Yes, tell me. They have a meeting for business. Okay, they have a meeting about business, maybe. So uh, let's see. The people in this conversation is Tom and Orson, all right? Tom and Orson. So just pay attention uh, to the pronunciation and then we are going to practice. Uh, my name is Tom. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I'm Orson. I work for Hodge. Oh, I know that company. There is an office in San Salvador downtown. Okay, hold on. Do you know this company, guys? Guys, do you know this company? No? No, teacher. I no. don't know. <laughs> Me neither. This is the oh. first time. Yes, and it says that it's in San Salvador. Look. Uh, yes, we are going, we're growing, we're growing. So there are not many branches in the country yet. There are few. What company do you work for? I work for Eco, the painting company. There are 25 branches in the country. That's great. I visited one of the stores the other day. Yeah, there are six in San Salvador. We are planning on launching one in Santa Ana these days. There isn't one yet. Okay. Can you tell me if you recognize one a specific vocabulary that we are using in this conversation? What is branches? Branches are the, the, the buildings, the buildings. In Spanish, that is called sucursales. Yeah. Sucursales, okay? That is the branches. Mm -hmm. All right. So um, here we have there is and there are, right? Any other question about the conversation right now? No? No. Okay, so uh, let's see. Here you are going to complete this exercise, but right now we are going to practice this conversation. The conversation uh, is going to be practiced uh, right now, just to check uh, if you have paid attention to the to the pronunciation. Uh, did you take a screenshot or do you have the student's book? Yes. Okay. So um, make sure that you complete the conversation and, and we are going to speak a little bit right now. Let's see. Okay, I'm going to let you choose. Only two people per room. Solo dos participantes por cada eh, room, okay? Okay. Yes, you decide which person do you work with, okay? You choose. You choose. Uh, what page is in the It's on page 19. Thank you. Uh-huh, 19.
join the rooms. Good evening. Good evening. I guess that I'm going to be with you. Okay. Because okay. the other ones uh, didn't enter the room. So uh, let's see. We have this. All right. You are, you are Tom. Okay. And I am Orson. All right. Very good. Okay. Go okay. ahead. My name is Tom. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I'm Orson. I work for her. Oh. oh, I know that company. There is an office in San Salvador, downtown. Yes, we're growing. So there are not many branches in the country yet. There are few. What company do you work for? I work for Echo, the painting company. There are uh, 25 branches in the country. That's great. I visited one of these stores the other day. Yeah, there are six in San Salvador. We are planning on launching one in Santa Ana these days. There isn't one yet. Okay, right. now switch. Switch. You, I start and you are the other person. My name is Tom. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I'm awesome. I work for Hope. Oh, I know that company. There is an office in San Salvador downtown. Yes, we are growing. So there are not many branches in the country yet. There are few. What company do you work for? I work for Eco, the painting company. There are 25 branches in the country. That's great. I visited one of the store the other day. Yeah, there are six in San Salvador. We are planning on launching one in Santa Ana these days. There isn't one yet. Okay, very good. So now, uh, can you please continue working on the exercise that I presented? I'm going to check your classmates. Okay. Okay. Very good. I'm going to come back in a few minutes. Thank you. Uh, okay. Yeah, I think. Ah, well. <laughs> sí. Ya que lo han puesto mal. Okay. That's uh -huh. great. I visited one of the stores the other day. Hey. Yeah, there are six in San Salvador. We are planning on launching one in Santa Ana this day. There isn't one yet. Okay. Okay. My name is. You too. 
I work for Holt. Oh, I know what that company. There is an office in San Salvador downtown. Yes, we're growing, so there are not many branches in the country yet. There are few. What company do you work for? I work for Echo, the painting company. There are 25 branches in the country. That's great. I visited one of the stores. The are What company do you work for? Hello, Mr. Ramirez. I work for Eco, the painting painting company. There are twenty five branches in the country. That's great. I visit one of the store the other day. Yeah, there are six in San Salvador. We are planning on launches. One in the Santana this day. There isn't one yet. Okay. Hello, Hello teacher. Hello. Hello teacher. How are you? <laughs> Dolores, I call your name and you were in present. Are you okay? Yes, yes. Okay. So can we complete the exercise? The exercise in number in page in the in the page, please. Do you have the student's book? Yes. yes. Okay, let's work on the exercise. Yes, that one. Okay, very good. <laughs> good students. Is, good students. The... Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, continue working. Hello. Hello, why are you alone? <laughs> <laughs> and Susan arrived the, the home and she connect in the house. Ah, uh, okay. And I said... Uh -huh. <laughs> Practicamos cuatro veces la conversación. Ajá, and you finish the exercise. Tenemos que completar el ejercicio. Ajá. Ah, eso no lo hicimos, pero ahorita lo completo. Ok. <laughs> ok, teacher, thank you. Ok. Hi, miss. Hello, how are you? Hi, You're practicing. Yeah, yeah, estábamos oh. tratando de... De entender la conversación. El contexto. Ah, ok. Ajá. Uh -huh. how, how is it? Uh, there, please. Perdón. Tell me this. Ah, do, do you finish the exercise? There is an exercise below that. Mm -hmm. Estábamos okay. viendo algunas palabras que no entendíamos. Ajá. Uh -huh. Por ejemplo. Por ejemplo, growing. Growing. Creciendo. Okay. Mm -hmm. Few. Few. Pocos. There are few. Pocos o pocas. Ah, okay. Y... The painting company. Ah, la, la compañía de, de pintura. Painting company. Ah. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, branches is sucursales. Sucursales, ¿verdad? Sí. Uh -huh. okay. Launching, launching es eh, lanzando, abriendo. Launching. Uh -huh. Okay, uh -huh. in the country, there are few other companies they work for. Did you finish the exercise that is below? Uh -huh. Number three, yeah? Yes. Number three. Uh -huh. Number three. There. Okay. Okay, can you complete one, it? One more minute. Okay, go ahead. Uh, okay. Okay, we finish. Claudia. 
Now we have finished the exercise. Yes. Okay. And your and your classmate. Dolores. <laughs> Dolores is here. Okay. You were the classmates, right? In the conversation. Dolores and Claudia. Yes? Okay. Yes, teacher. Okay. We are about to start. Lourdes is going to read the conversation with Claudia. Okay. Por ser tan puntuales en regresar, Lourdes and Claudia, first couple. <laughs> Dolores, Dolores okay. and Dolores and Nelson, second couple. Dolores and Nelson, la segunda pareja. And let's see, one more. Let's see, Luis Armando and Oscar Gamero, the third couple. Edwin wants to participate. Edwin and Karina, okay? So go ahead, Claudia. Uh, my name is Tom. Nice to meet you. Nice to, sorry. Nice to meet you too. I'm Orson. I work for Holt. Oh, no. That company. There is an office in San Salvador downtown. Yes. We're growing, so there are not many branches in the country yet. There are few. What company do you work for? I work for Eco, the painting company. There are um, 25 branches in the country. That's great. I visited one of the store the other day. Yeah, there are six in San Salvador. We are planning on launching one in Santana these days. There isn't one yet. Thank you so much. Okay, very good. Very good. Thank you. Second couple was Dolores and Nelson. Okay. My name is Tom. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I'm Orson. I work of, for object. Oh, I know that company. There is an office in San Salvador downtown. Yes, we're growing, so there are not many branches in the country yet. There are few. What company do you work for? I work for Echo, the painting company. There are and uh, there are twenty five branches in the country. That's great. I visited one of the stores the other day. Yeah, there are six in San Salvador. We are planning on launching one in Santa Ana these days. These days, there is not one yet. Thank you. Thank you. The next one is uh, Edwin, right? No. Who was it? Edwin and o Luis. Oscar. No. Oscar, Oscar and, and Luis. Yeah, Luis. Okay, go ahead. Okay, I'm Tom. My name is Tom. Nice to meet you. Luis, you're mute. Sorry. <laughs> nice to meet you too. I know so. I work of for Hodget. Oh, I know that company. There is an office in San Salvador downtown. Yes, we're growing. So there are not many virtues in the country. Yet, there are few. But that company do you work for? I work for Echo, the painting company. There are uh, 25 branch in the country. That's right. I visited one on the store the other day. Yeah, there are six in San Salvador. We're planning, planning 
on launching one in Santana. These days, there isn't one yet. Okay, thank you. Okay, very good, thank you. And Edwin. Aha, con Karina, Go ahead. Okay. My name is Tom, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I am also, I work for H-O-D-J-E. Oh, I know that company. There is an office in San Salvador downtown. Yes, we're growing, so there are not many branches in the country, yes. There are a few. What company do you work for? I work for ECO, the painting company. There are 25 branches in the country. That's great. I visit one of the store the other day. Yeah, there are six in San Salvador. We are planning on launching one in Santa Ana this day. There isn't one yet. Okay, very good. Thank you so much, guys. Good job. I guess that many of you are having internet problems because uh, some people were texting me that they were out because of that. Well, I hope that you can fix that uh, soon. And let's continue. All right, so no questions about the vocabulary in that conversation, no? No. No, okay. No, teacher. What do you have for the exercise? We have, a, supposedly we were to answer these spaces in blank using is or are. Number one, there are three offices in San Salvador. Which one did there you are. write? There are, okay. Why did you write there are there and not there is? Because it's plural. plural. Because it's plural, okay. because it's three offices. Okay, very good. And in number two, what do you have? Yes, there is. There is, okay. It's singular, right? Yeah. It's there is singular. one store. Okay, very good. And number three? There is. They are. There is. They are. They are. Tell me, Oscar. There. Is. 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 There is not any offices. Okay, any other opinion? Yeah. Another opinion? Are there are there is uh -huh. there are not any offices uh -huh. because you have offices and offices it's a uh, plural right plural. but in this case it's negative because you have not right there are not any offices in this region okay very yes. good don't worry if you have a mistake don't worry this is just to check if you were you know a acquainted with the topic so right now yes the topic is uh, there is and there are we are going to check the affirmative form the affirmative form or the positive form who can help me reading uh, the definition of there is and there are who can help me Anayansi, go ahead. Um, uh, I don't not understand. No, just read. Solo ayúdeme a leerlo acá. Okay, okay. There is and there are two expression. Um. No, to expression that the do not that sometimes some something or some 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 one some one x six. Okay, thank you, thank you, Anayansi. So there is and there are two expressions that tells me 
that something or someone exists, okay? So we are going to check the difference in some examples. There is, you told me, there is is singular. It's for one, uh, when you want to refer to something, to one in a specific, okay? And in this case, there is, is also uncountable, okay? Uncountable. Uh, you have there the examples. Uh, let's see, Edwin, can you help me reading the example number one? Yes, teacher. The example number one, here. Ah, okay. There is a post office in front of the battery. Okay, thank you. So do you identify, we have here, there is. There is is the expression. A post office is singular, singular. In front of the bakery is the complement, okay? That is like, yes. hay una oficina de correos en frente de? La postulería. Ajá, uh -huh, de la panadería. Panadería, panadería. Hay uh -huh. una, okay? One, because it is singular. There is a post office in front of the bakery. Okay, the example number two, uh, Danis. There is a new branch in my work company. Okay, very good. Singular. Thank you. Uh, lower yes. this. Lower this. Number three. Um, there is there is salt in the kitchen. Okay, what do we have here? Uh, singular or uncountable? It is uncountable. Okay, it's uncountable. Why? Because we cannot count the salt. Y no podemos, aquí estamos viendo el there is como algo incontable, ¿verdad? Porque la yes. sal no se puede contar. Yes. Entonces, yes. a menos que esté empaquetado. In a recipe. Mm -hmm. Or, Or in container. Soap. Exactly. Yes. So, in this case, it's uncountable. Uh, the next example, Luis, Luis, can you help me with the next example, please? There is a, there is a enough coffee in the cup. Okay, there is enough coffee in the cup. Okay, thank you. And in this case, is singular or is uncountable? Uncountable, teacher. Uncountable. Uncountable because we cannot count the coffee, we cannot count, count the liquid. You know, you can say one cup of coffee that yeah. is countable, but here it says there is enough. Okay, aquí está como incontable porque estoy diciendo hay suficiente café. No estoy diciendo hay una taza de café que es muy diferente, verdad? Okay, so there is enough coffee. These are just a couple of examples when you use there is for singular and there is for uncountables, right? Uh, do you have any question about there is right now? No? Can you give me one more example, please? One or two more examples? There are a coffee station. Excuse me, say it again. There are is mm. a coffee station. Uh -huh. There is a coffee station. Coffee station. Okay, there is a coffee station. Thank you. Another example. Yes, Go ahead. Karina mm. and Edwin. Go ahead. Okay. There, is, there is my computer. Um. Okay. There is a computer. There is a computer. Okay. Thank you, Edwin. There is a pollution. There is pollution. A pollution. Pollution. Okay. Uh. Just pay attention the, to this. In the country. Thank you. There is pollution in the country. Pay attention to this. Eh, vaya, cuando voy a usar el there is con un noun que es incontable, no le voy a poner el a. ¿Ok? 
Pero si mm. voy a usar el there is o para mencionar que hay una cosa o hay alguien, sí le voy a poner el a. Yo puedo decir, there is one, one girl in the corner. Hay una chica en la esquina. Okay? Pero eh, no puedo decir, there, there, is, eh, there is what? Eh, there is sugar. Uh -huh, there is a sugar. There is a sugar. Hay una azúcar. En español sí está correcto que decimos. Pa? Me da un azúcar cuando vamos a la tienda. Me da un azúcar. Me da una sal. Ahí sí, o sea, porque ya es, es otro idioma. Pero en inglés eh, es incorrecto. Tienen que referirse. Me vende una bolsa o una libra de azúcar. Una libra de sal. Entonces, diríamos. Eh, there is a bag or there is one pound of sugar. Okay? Ya, ahí sí ya se puede hacer contable, ¿verdad? Pero de lo contrario, no. Okay? Do you know what I mean? Okay. Yes. Okay. So, no questions about this right now? No? No questions. No. Hablen ahora o callen no. para siempre, porque después vienen los ejercicios. No. No questions. Okay. So, continuing, we have the opposite. That is the plural. Ah, y en el ejemplo de Karina, quería hacer énfasis en el ejemplo de Karina también. Ella dijo, there yeah. is my computer. There is my computer. O sea, uh -huh. sí está bien gramaticalmente eh, dicho, ¿verdad? Pero, 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 eh, allí no estoy usando el there is como el verbo, digamos, a ver, de existencia. Solamente estoy diciendo, eh, allá, allá está mi computadora, ¿sí? There is my computer, allá está mi computadora, ¿sí? Ahí yo no estoy diciendo, eh, hay una computadora, o hay dos computadoras, ¿ok? ¿Sí? Yes? Ok. Okay. No, no, no todo, pero, pero sí. No, ok, díganme que no se entiende, porque como les dije, ya viene un ejercicio <ríe> a continuación. Ajá, tell me. I listen to you. Caso, o sea, eh, igual, ¿cómo vamos a poder distinguirlo en el ejemplo que presentó Karina? Ajá. Porque podría ser, there is a computer. Ajá, o sea, pero is... no está bien, supuestamente. Ese criterio de... Ajá, no, es que vaya. Acá, yo eh, dijimos, ¿verdad? El singular va a ser singular cuando eh, estemos acá denotando que hay una cosa, ¿verdad? Acá yo digo, there is a post office. Hay una oficina de correo. There is a computer. There is a computer. Hay una computadora. ¿Sí? Y luego viene el ejemplo que ella daba. Lo voy a abrir acá. Vaya. Me decía ella, there, there is my computer. Entonces, lo correcto sería, there is one o, sí, one o a computer. ¿Ok? Si yo digo, there is my computer, estoy diciendo, allí está mi computadora. Allí está mi computadora. ¿Ok? Y acá, there is one computer o a computer, yo estoy diciendo, hay una computadora. ¿Cuál es la diferencia? Pues que acá yo estoy usando my porque estoy refiriéndome a mí, a, a, a algo que es mío. Y acá no. Acá estoy diciendo que hay algo en existencia y que no sé si es mío, si es de Dani, si es de Edwin. Claro, mm. yo puedo poner acá abajo para especificar que esa, esa computadora es mía. Eh, there is one o a computer, pero tendría que agregar una palabra más. And it's mine. ¿Vean? Mm, hay una computadora mm. y es mía. ¿Ok? Pero ahí sería más larga la, la oración. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Yes? You're now. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Thank you. Okay, you're welcome. So, continuing. 
we have uh, this, there are the opposite. It's plural and it's countable. O sea que el there is solo lo usamos a partir del uno. Del uno y hasta ahí se queda. El there are se usa del two and up. Del dos para arriba. Examples. Okay. There are two new branches of my company in the city. Look. Two new branches of my company in the city. Okay. What is the plural noun there? ¿Cuál sería el sujeto plural que tenemos ahí? Branches. 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 Plural. Yes, yeah. branches. Okay, two branches. Uh, in example number two, there are some new people working here. What, what is the, the plural? People. People, okay. People. Okay. Y la palabra que me está denotando, quantity, ¿cuál sería? Some. Some, ok, no necesariamente voy a poner two, three, four, five, six, and so on, no. I can use uh, some other expressions, for example, some, uh, a few, a lot many. of, many. Mm -hmm. And in the last example, there are new machines here. O simplemente no digo cuántas hay, pero... Si menciono que es muchas, son muchas. Eh, there are new machines here, ¿ok? Si se fijan, no estoy usando ni números ni palabras que me digan cuántas máquinas yo tengo aquí. Entonces solo digo, there are new machines here, general, general, ¿ok? Eh, but there is a plural because you can count machines. You can say one machine, two machines three machines, and so on, okay? So that is the difference, okay? Creo que el there are es más eh, easy que el otro, yes? Yeah. Are you following me? Yes. Yeah. Okay, so we have the practice right now. Look, <coughs> this is going to be in groups. I don't know if you can see the screen, yes. Okay, this practice, you are going to write or you are going to describe what you see in this picture using there is and there are. You can take notes, okay, in your notebooks. Uh, maybe you can, you can have a screenshot of this mm -hmm, and you work. This one, okay, Did you do you have it? Yes? No. Okay. Wait me, please. Okay, I wait you. Thank you. Okay. So I'm going to open the, the, the rooms. And over there, you are going to share your answers with the classmates. Susi. Susi no tiene grupo, Susi. Estaba con los urdes, pero no me puedo conectar. Espérame, ahorita la mando con los urdes. Los urdes están en el room 3. Yes, en el 3. Ajá. Ok. basket.
Luis Apasca. Okay. Number three. Sera. 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 Three for forks. Four. There are two. There are pair two pair of shoes. shoes. Two pair of shoes. Okay, number five. There is a shave. There is. Teacher. Okay. Yes, Chair. tell me, tell me. Eh, uh, tengo una pequeña duda. Uh -huh. Con la expresión que le había dado, la de there is pollution in the city, no es a pollution, ¿verdad? No. There is pollution in the city. Uh -huh. But, y para manejar, ajá, para ser más específico en esa expresión, tendría que poner, por ejemplo, a ver, There is very pollution in the city, or lot. Puedo usar lot. Ah, ah, para decir que hay mucho. Ajá, ah. puedo usar much. There is so much pollution in the city. So much. So Ajá, much. so much. Ajá. There is so much pollution in the city. Mm -hmm. There is so much pollution in the city. Okay. Esa era mi duda, teacher. Thanks. Okay. Digamos, Karina. Lo siento. <laughs> okay, the number six is there, there, is. there is a NIF. Así se pronuncia. Okay. Y le falta la. There are pumps. Spoons. Los pumps. Hi, teacher. Hello, you finished. Yeah. Okay, can you give me your answers just to check if you are okay? In the seven and the eight. From one to eight. In the seven and the eight is there are. Uh huh. Is is correct? Yes, it's Say correct. Say there are cups. Uh mm huh. -hmm. And the eight there are spoons. Spoons. Yes, it's correct. Spons. Okay. Mm -hmm. The next one. I mean, number one. Number one. Mm -hmm. There are two plates. There are two plates. Three, 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 mm -hmm. three. Number two. There is a basket. Uh -huh. a basket. Excellent. Three. There are three. There are three. Four. Four. Mm -hmm. Very good. Four. There are two pairs of shoes. Mm -hmm. Number five. There is a chair. Okay. And six. There is a knife. There is okay. a knife. Okay. Yes. So you are all right. We are about to continue in a few minutes. Just let me close the rooms. Okay. And get ready. Okay. Are you there? Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Okay, very good. 
So we are going to continue and I want you to please tell me the, the, the answers. Who wants to give me the answer number one? There are. There two are uh -huh, two plates. Thank you, Oscar, very good. And number two, Karina. There is a basket. There is a basket. Thank you. Another volunteer for number three? Me teacher. Uh -huh, go ahead. There are three forks. Thank you, Edwin. Very good. The next one. Me teacher. Go ahead. Go ahead. The, there are two pairs of shoes. Thank you. Very good. Next. Me teacher. Go ahead, Anayansi. There is a chair. Thank you. Very good. Next one. Next. Another volunteer. Me. Go ahead. There is. Uh huh. Knife. It's knife. 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 Uh huh. There is a knife. Knife. Thank you. And number number eight. No. Seven. Uh -huh. there, are there, are, there are cups. There are cups. Thank you. And the last one? There are spoons. Thank you. Very good. So, was this exercise easy or difficult? Easy. Easy, right? Easy, peasy. Thank you. So we are going to switch to the negative form. The negative is this one, look. There isn't, there isn't is for the singulars. And there aren't is for plurals, okay? There isn't is for singulars and there aren't is for plurals, all right? <laughs> and let's see. And uh, who can help me reading the examples? Who help me? Danis? Danis, can you help me reading the examples? Karina, Karina, what Yes. Oh, okay. Okay, two Danis and two Karina. Okay. Okay. Let's start, Karina. Karina, okay. you start. Okay. There are many customers today. Mm -hmm. There isn't any water left in the container. Thank you, Karina. Danis, go. There are branches in the country. Mm -hmm. There isn't um, competency. competency for the company. Okay, thank you. So as you see, this is not a big deal. This is easy. There aren't is for there are. There isn't goes for there is, okay? And it's the same. You can use the words or you can use numbers. Here I used many. There aren't many customers today. No hay muchos clientes hoy. There isn't any water left in the container. No hay mucha agua que quede en el contenedor. Uh, there aren't branches, no hay muchas sucursales uh -huh, en el país. And there isn't competency for the company. No hay competencia para la compañía. Okay, so this is what you need to know okay? in order to uh, manage well the difference between the affirmative and the negative. These are the negatives, okay? So let's see. Look, what do we have here, Lourdes? Can you give me what is the question there? Okay, what are the missing things and spaces in this house? Mm -hmm. what, are the, what are the missing things and the spaces in this house? ¿Qué es lo que falta en esta casa? ¿Cuáles son las cosas y espacios que hacen falta en esta casa? For example, here you have there aren't doors. There aren't doors, okay? And okay. there isn't a 
Ahí ustedes Bed. continúan. ¿Qué no hay ahí? There are furniture. Ajá. There, no. Furniture is uncountable. Furniture is uncountable. There isn't furniture. Uh -huh. Furniture. O sea, la palabra mueblería eh, okay. es algo incontable, ¿sí? Uh -huh. okay. Ya si yo quiero hacer la palabra eh, mueblería, contable diría, um, there are two sofas. There are three chairs. ¿Ok? So, there isn't living room. Uh -huh. There isn't a living room. A living room. So this is what you are going to be working right now in pairs again. Mi pareja, lo vamos a hacer nuevamente. I need you to discuss and to get as many uh, sentences as possible, okay? Is clear the exercise? Yes? Yes. Okay. I'm going to send you to the breakup rooms again to work. Una taza. Teacher. We need help. You what? Ya la vamos a pedir. We didn't que have the, the screenshot. <laughs> no, yeah. no le tomaron la screenshot. Ahorita voy. Okay. La voy a etiquetar para que nos mande la captura. <laughs> ahí está. La captura. Ahí está, ahí está. Ok. Uh -huh. okay. Okay. Ah, no, no se lo está copiando. Okay. No, okay. <laughs> what are missing these in spray in the house? Mm -hmm. The missing spaces. Compartir. Okay. okay. Yeah, seco. There. There isn't. There, there aren't a, a bell. There, there aren't a, a bell. Es cama, bell. ¿cómo se dice? Bell. Bell, bell. There aren't yes. a, pero entonces es, es una cama o son varias camas? Son varias camas porque en una casa pero, este siempre hay familia. Sí. Entonces no llevaría, no llevaría la, el A. Solo sería there, there aren't, aren't solo sería cama, bells. There aren't bells. 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 Mm -hmm. eh, la otra sería. There. No, no. The, there aren't. aren't. ¿Cómo se dice teacher? Teacher, juego de muebles. Living room, no. Furniture. Furniture. For Furniture. For, 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 furniture. 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 Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Furniture. Furniture. Uh -huh. furniture. Yes. Entonces sería, there aren't furniture. Furniture. No, pero ahí furniture es eh, lo que decía, va. Es eh, incontable. Incontable. Uh -huh. Es uh -huh. incontable. Uh -huh. Es un contable. Ya si yo quiero especificar para que sea contable, diría, there, there are two sofas, there are mm -hmm. three chairs, ya especifico de qué estoy hablando, mm -hmm. de qué molería, uh -huh. 
Porque la palabra furniture es como general. Uh -huh. eh, pero si yo quiero decir no hay muebles. There isn't furniture in the house. O sea que furniture no es plural. No, sería ah. un concept. Uh -huh. Yo pensé que era plural, muebles. Uh -huh. No, en español sí es plural, pero en inglés uh -huh. no. Furniture, in general. Ah, ok. Ok. Bueno, Entonces que tendríamos no es... que especificar lo que queremos decir. El uh -huh. mueble que queremos decir. Uh -huh. Entonces sería, there is a sofa. Ajá, uh -huh. there isn't uh -huh. a sofa. Ajá, uh -huh. no hay un sofá. Ok. Ah, por ahí vamos. There... Ajá, uh -huh. there isn't. Sofa. Tampoco. A table. Uh -huh. Hi, teacher. Hello. Hello, teacher. Hello. Is Fidel working? He just joined. Por si no ha comprendido él la actividad y me le explica. No sé si ya se conectó, Fidel. No. No lo he visto, Iván. No. No he visto a Fidel, pero no. No, no se ha conectado. Oh, ok. Ok. So tell me, do you have any questions? I have a question in the. Por ejemplo, there is in a kitchen o there are a kitchen. Tomando en cuenta que la cocina puede tener muchas cosas. Ajá. Ah, pero la palabra kitchen en sí solo sería singular, una. There oh, isn't a kitchen o there uh -huh. isn't one kitchen. No hay Ajá, una de... cocina. Ajá. Y después Ajá, de especifican que... ustedes. There, there, are, there is a refrigerator. Uh -huh. Por ejemplo, there is a sofa. There is, there is o there isn't? Is, there isn't a sofa. Uh -huh. There isn't there is. a sofa. Uh -huh. No hay un sofa. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Está bien. Y en, en, en una, una duda. Uh -huh. En Estados Unidos, bueno, aquí normalmente a los sofás los tomamos en cuenta como, como juego de tres, ¿verdad? Juego uh -huh. de salas. No sé si en Estados Unidos es igual. Uh, se toma como sofa y ellos le llaman al, al sofá que es individual, le llaman arm chair. Arm como de brazo y chair como decía, arm chair. Uh -huh. Son individuales entonces ahí. Ajá, uh -huh. al individual. Allá los otros sí son sofa. Uh -huh. Ok, another question. Claudia. There are a uh, bedroom. There are bedrooms. Mm -hmm. Bedrooms. Bed uh -huh. uh -huh. There are bedrooms. Porque es plural. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Para que no me vean, digo yo. Hi, Miss. How are you? ¿Cómo dice que pone Ay, la cama? Ah, sí, tengo los dos chiquitos. Ah, tienes so sueño. Tired, very ah, tired. Very tired, sleepy. Estoy cansada. Ah, yes. Okay. yes, yes, yes. Ah, eso teníamos duda, teacher. Yes. ¿Cómo se dice? Como que es, eh, me siento mucho sueño, digamos. I'm sleepy. I am I'm sleepy. sleepy. I'm sleepy. Ah, ok. <laughs> sleepy. No, sleeping. Sleepy. No, sleeping. Con sleeping. Y. Con Y. Con Y. Ajá. Ah, entonces sí es sleeping. No. Ah, porque para mí sleeping es durmiendo. No, es sleepy. Ajá. Ok, es S L I I P Y. Ajá. Sleep, como la palabra sleep, la P es Ah, es sleepy. Uh -huh. Ajá. Es sleepy. Ah, ok, es sleepy. Uh -huh. Ah, ok, yo escuchaba sleeping. Uh, okay. We'll finish the activity. You finish the activity, okay? Yes. You're tired. <laughs> Cansadita, yes. Pues, entonces no lo voy a dejar hoy para los 10 minutos. Lo voy a dejar para mañana. 
oiga. <risa> ok, thank you. Bueno, mañana no se tiene que sentir thank cansada. <risa> a Ay, Lourdes vamos a dejar hoy. Lo digo yo que sí. Ok. <risa> vaya, vaya Lourdes. Okay. <risa> Thank you. Okay. We show you the exercise. Eh, ya, ya lo vamos a decir en, en público, pero sí, díganme lo okay. mismo. Ahorita Bye. aquí. Uh -huh. Tell me. Ah, but, but, um, is, okay. Is there is a there isn't a kitchen? Uh -huh. There isn't a bathroom. Uh -huh. There aren't bedrooms. Uh -huh. There isn't a dining room. Uh -huh. There isn't a garden. Uh -huh. There aren't pets. There aren't pictures. There isn't a clothes. There isn't a clothes. Mm -hmm. Se le congeló. Sí, se le congeló. Okay. Continue you, <laughs> Okay. There aren't plants. Uh, there isn't a garage. And there are in people. Okay. Estamos bien mm -hmm. ahí entonces, Lourdes. Mm -hmm. Okay. A ver si Perfecto. devuelve la señal a la compañía. <ríe> sí, yo creo que es el modo de la compu está cansado. <ríe> que es lunes, dice, y el cuerpo lo sabe. <ríe> Ay, no. Okay, we finished. We finished. Yeah. Okay, so let's see. Uh, Jancy, can you give me one number from one to twenty? Un número de luz al veinte, Ana Jancy. Uh, nueve. Nine. Nine. No, he's not here. No, we know him. Ah. <laughs> Así soy, no soy buena para... <laughs> Give me another one. Deme otro. <laughs> um, seven. Ah, tampoco vino. <laughs> uh -huh. Five. Five. Claudia, Claudia Lorena is here. Uh -huh. <laughs> Okay, you are, you are. Tell me, what do you have for this exercise? Uh, there isn't a kitchen. Mm -hmm. There isn't a living room. Mm -hmm. There aren't a bedroom. Mm -hmm. There aren't a bedroom or there aren't there, bedrooms? There aren't bedroom. Okay. Uh, there isn't a sofa. Uh -huh. There aren't a picture. Uh -huh. There isn't a table. Okay. Finish. Finish. Okay. Now, Claudia, can you choose somebody to share their answers? Elija a un compañero o compañera para que, para que comparta sus respuestas. Ten. Ten. Oh, ah, por número. El número o el nombre. Yo decía por el nombre. Es ¿eh? oh. más difícil por el nombre. Alguien que le caiga bien. Danis. 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 Uh -huh. no, no. Danis, por acá. Vamos a ocupar mi teléfono. Oh, no, no está Danis. ¿Qué le habrá pasado a Danis? No, no está Danis. Mire, hoy que fue seleccionado. Ajá. ¿A quién elige? Eh...
Carmen. Carmen, Carmen, no, Carmen tampoco, no sé por qué se desconectó, me imagino que están teniendo problemas con el eh, Inter. Luis. Luis, Luis. Ajá, Luis is here. Tell me, Luis. Ok. There aren't bells. Ajá. There isn't a sofa. Ajá. Uh -huh. There isn't a table. Uh -huh. uh, there isn't a mirror. Uh -huh. Aquí tengo dudas, teacher, con el nombre de este aparato. Uh -huh. There isn't a fireplace. Uh -huh. It's no, okay. Chim chimenea, it's okay? Mm -hmm. O también puede decir chimney. Chimney. Ah, uh -huh. es el que... Uh -huh. And there is a washing machine. Okay. Thank you. Thank you very much. So this exercise, I guess, was easy, right? Yes? Yes. Okay. Now uh, I want you to tell me, did you check the videos and the links that you have in the book? Yes? I don't see it, miss. No. Okay. I don't. You, you didn't. Sorry, teacher, no. No, okay, but I have an idea here. I have an idea. We are going to be uh, speaking about bank branches. Can you tell me any idea of the banks that you know, the, the banks and their branches that we have here in El Salvador? Maybe Torre Cuscatlán. Ajá, uh -huh. okay. Another one. Eh, World Trade. La pirámide. No me acuerdo el nombre. World Trade Center. Trade Center. Here in El Salvador. Luis, here in El Salvador. Yeah, World okay. Trade Center. Okay, but torre, now. Torre, torre Futura. Mm, okay, but my question is, do you know what is the definition of the bank branch? Who can help me read in this uh, definition? Who can help me? Quien me ayuda a leer la definición del bank branch? Only one. Me, teacher. Go ahead. Um, definition of bank branch. If you've opened a bank account at some point during your life, you probably set foot in a bank branch. A bank branch typically consists of a collection of tellers who can aid you in withdrawing money, depositing in cash and more. Okay, thank you. So do you know this word, guys? Withdrawing money and depositing checks? No. No? Withdrawing? Withdrawing is when you uh, take, out, take out the money. Uh, retirar dinero. Mm. Withdrawing money. Okay. And depositing checks is when you go to the bank and put the check, you know, into account or into another account. Como regresar. Yeah. Uh -huh. Something like that. Something like that. Okay. So that is the bank branch. Thank you. Uh, another volunteer, maybe Karina, who can help me read in the number three. Okay. Uh -huh. Banks, banks have many locations in place to ensure that their money is not stolen. So I should come as okay. no surprise that bank often have safe deposit boxes enable customers. These are strictly 
as accessible accessible throw throw palm uh, brush a loaf you I thought sorry although although mm -hmm. you like to need to pay an annual fee for them okay thank you thank you so in in brief and see in conclusion we have these questions to consider what's the best bank in el salvador what's the best bank in el salvador for you Mm -hmm. What's the best? Mm. Banco Agricola. No. Are you sure? No. <laughs> no. No. Ninguno. No. No. Ninguno. Okay. No. That's acceptable. What about you, Edwin? Which one do you consider is the best? None. No, teacher. <laughs> None. Okay. No. <laughs> Susie, for you? I think that Banco Agricola, maybe. Banco Agricola, okay. Some people. Tiene más cajeros y todo, pues. Ah, okay. Okay, very good. The teller. Está pagando por patrocinarlo. I think we'll play. Okay, okay. So it's influencer. <laughs> that that is the next question, uh, Susie. Which bank do you think has a lot of branches in the country and worldwide? Uh -huh. El banco que tiene más sucursales en el país y a nivel mundial. In the in the Salvador, I think Banco Agricola. Okay. In the worldwide, maybe Scotia Bank. Scotia Bank. Okay. Do you agree, guys? Luis, Luis, what do you yes. think? Um, Anaya? I think. It, uh huh. Go ahead. Uh, Bank of Rico. <laughs> okay. And you, Anayansi, what do you it think? That's uh, very good at this. Uh, Promerica. Bank Promerica. Credomatic. No, Promerica. Ah, Promerica. Okay. Yeah. Okay, very good. Thank you. And do you consider, guys, is it an easy process to have a saving account in a bank? National bank. Easy yes. or difficult? Oh, it's easy. Difficult. It's easy when you open the account. Mm -hmm. But if you have a, a credit is credit. Credit, credit. In credit, mm -hmm. it, the process is more large. Uh -huh. Uh -huh, that's right. And difficult. That's right. And what is better, national or international banks? Oscar, what do you think? International bank. International bank. Yes, for the financial support. Okay, very good. Karina, for you, national or international? I think international because international. there are, there have uh, more protection. Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. Thank you. So we have almost the last activity. We have the group work. And in this case, what are we going to do? Uh, basically, two exercises for practice. Number one, you are going to correct the mistake. And in number two, you are going to prepare a conversation that lasts for two minutes about your companies. You are going to say the location of the company, the branches, the offices, in what cities they are present, okay? You can, you can be uh, paying attention to the conversation in exercise two as a reference, okay? Yes? Yes. Yes. Okay, did you take the screenshot? 
Yeah. Remember to do always that. In the screenshot, no proceed. <laughs> okay. Yes. You, you take it. Yes. Okay. Do you want to change groups or you want to continue with the same? With the same. It's with the same. For me. Yes. Okay. Yes, Go ahead. Same. I like Lourdes. Oh, <laughs> okay. <thank you. laughs> okay. Go ahead. Join the rooms. We need, we need to resolve the, uh, the mistake. Yeah. Okay. The first is there is two brushes in El Salvador, but it's plural. Exactly. Is there are? There are. There are two brushes in El Salvador. And number two, there are one facility, facility enabled. Okay. Um, here, I think, yes, is is singular. Uh, there is a um, facility there is, enabled. Uh -huh. There is one or ah. There is one. Uh -huh. There is one or there is ah. Okay. There is a new office facility. Uh -huh. Y en la tres sería there are. The three. There are a new office. There are. Pero sin el A. Oh, pero mire, ajá, porque ya eso le iba a decir, there is uh -huh. A, y son uh -huh. nuevas oficinas. Ajá, uh -huh. there English. are new offices. <laughs> ah, ok, the English, there is a new offices. <laughs> there is our... Sería there are new offices. There are new offices. New offices. There are not um, material to work. There, there are there there not is there isn't materials to work. Material, comprendo que es incontable. Ah, sí. Pero sería there isn't. Mm -hmm. There isn't material to work. Mm -hmm. No, there are materials to work. It's materials. A plural. Plural, uh-huh. Yes, there are materials to work. Ajá, yo lo tomaba como que era incontable. In this case, Entonces, it's dirías... countable, plural. Ah, ok. Ok, aportaba un error. In a five, there are. There are... See the person, more conversation. So that's a reference. See. Sí. Okay. Tendremos que agarrar. Uh -huh. Put the conversation and we try to 
Vamos. Usted va a empezar. Ok. But, uh, ¿Dónde está? Para tomarla de ejemplo. Ah, perdón. Yeah. Qué mal servicio. <ríe> <laughs> okay, that I am a star. Edwin, okay. sir, yes, you, you stay with me tonight after the class, okay? For 10 minutes. Ah, okay, teacher. Mm -hmm. No problem. No problem. Tengo toda la noche. <laughs> <laughs> no, only 10 minutes. Only 10 <laughs> minutes. Okay. Okay. Okay, yes. Okay, Karina. Y Lourdes, um, uh, very, very fine. Um, How do you say, oh, oh, you say fine, okay, so, oh, oh well, I see, fine, uh -huh. I get married. Puede decir I'm okay, también, si no quiere decir fine. Yes. Okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. I get married, Seria. Uh -huh. I get married. Uh -huh. Yes, yeah. and I say, really? Uh -huh. When? Really? Where? Voy a preguntar. <laughs> ¿Cuándo y dónde? <laughs> ¿Por qué no me invitó? <laughs> ¿Con quién le va a decir? ¿Cuándo? <laughs> <laughs> no. Dieron pastel, dieron pizza. <risa> <risa> okay, I married in... Podemos usar, es una conversación ficticia, ¿verdad? O sea, no es... Ajá. Ajá. No es de nuestro lugar de trabajo, ¿o sí? Sí, tiene que ser de trabajo. O sea, basándose en, en esta, en la que tienen ahí oh. en pantalla. Ajá. Ajá. Es que íbamos Pero a hacer, íbamos íbamos a hacer un pastel. Oh, la va a contratar. Ajá. Es que no. iba a poner que ella trabajaba en un hotel y que ahí tenía sucursales en no sé dónde. Eso íbamos ah, a hacer así. Ah, ok. Ajá. Ajá. Siempre y cuando usen el Derry, sí, el Derry. Ajá, uh -huh. ajá. Ok. Uh -huh. Sí, sí, sí. Ah, ok. Ok. Uh -huh. Ok. Um, ok. Where. Ajá. Quedamos como really, when, and really. They're not. Uh, they're not. Sería, they're not. They're not. They're not. Puede ser, there aren't. There aren't, ajá. Material to work. Ajá, ahí está al revés. There aren't, aren't materials, materials to work. To work. Y there is not three boxes in the law. There is not there are in the there lobby. aren't in, a, in, in the five there aren't, see, see, there there aren't, aren't see. three box aren't there aren't Are we ready? Yes. yes okay. Let's wait for your classmates to come back. Okay, I guess that you are here and well, we are about to 
start with this. We had the group work, right? We were supposed to uh, correct the mistakes. So who can help me in the, uh, identifying the mistake number one? There is two branches in El Salvador. What is the correct form? There are. There are. There are. Uh -huh. there are, right? In El Salvador. Mm -hmm. There, sorry, let's see. There are, you say. There are two branches in El Salvador. Okay, there are two branches in El Salvador. There are, okay. In number two? There is. There is. There is. There is one facilities available. Are, are you sure? Are you sure? Um, there are there, one facilities. What is the are, mistake? There are facilities one. available. Uh -huh. We eliminate one. 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 Um, we eliminate one. There are, there are, there are facilities are. available. Okay. Mm. Uh, the next one, number three. There is are, a new office. There are. There are. There are. Oh, there is, is a new office. office. There is a new office. Oh, there are new offices. Y quitamos la A, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Number four. Number four, there are no, there not are materials to work. They aren't materials to work. Aren't. Uh -huh. There aren't, está al revés, there aren't. Podría ir, there are not, o there aren't materials to work, okay? Uh, in number five, there is, there is not three boxes in the lobby. There they aren't. aren't. There, there aren't. aren't. There, there aren't. aren't. Mm -hmm. There aren't. Very good. Now uh, you are supposed to role play a, a, a conversation about the company. Okay. So who wants to go first? Voluntariamente. Mm -hmm. El que pasa se va a ir yendo. No. Oscar. <laughs> okay. Oscar, voluntar. No, pero es mentira eso que se va a Oscar. Okay. Ah, bueno. Vamos a escuchar a los compañeros. Ok. Go ahead, Oscar. ¿Quién fue su compañera o compañero? Ana Yancy. Ana Yancy. Ana Yancy. Mm. She's not there. Yes, yes, es que ah. me está. Ah, ahí está. Ah, ok. Está. Bye. The Go company. Ahead. The company of Anna Yancy. Mm -hmm. Anna Yancy works in a beach store in the Tunco Beach. The name is Mara Shops. There is only one branch. The competent name is Valdison Shop. Are two branch in the Tunco Beach. Okay. Ana Yancy? Yes. That, that is a conversation, Oscar. Oscar? Que no lo terminamos. Ah, you didn't finish. Okay, you didn't finish. Okay, thank you. At least you got something. Okay, thank you. Uh, let's see another one. Uno más por ahí. Ahora que vemos poquitos y poquitas. Uh -huh. Edwin en Karina. El dúo dinámico. Yeah. <risa> ok, teacher. Solo permítame. <risa> Hello, can you see the chat, please? Yes, I see. Um, 
Thank you. We practice the the conversation, Susan. Can you see, Miss? What? <laughs> <laughs> You're talking about chatting. No terminamos. Ah, no ah you didn't no, finish. finish. Ah, you didn't finish. Okay. No, I, I yes. you, you wrote that in the chat. Ah, okay. okay. <laughs> Nelson, you finished. Claudia. Claudia, you finish. Teacher. Uh huh. Eh, uh, and me. Eh, finish. Okay, go ahead. Okay. 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 My name is Karina. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I Edwin. I work for CLT. Oh, I know the company. There is in there is an office in Sonsonate downtown. Yes, I go in, so there are not many branches. Going to get. There are few. What company do you work for? I work for Simang. Uh, it's a uh, Asimam Frank Frankish 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 to Indictex. Ya no te dijo si le venía dando problemas el camión. There are four. Vaya, no, 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 there are four yeah. four branches there. La medicina, mamá. Ana Yancy, can you please turn off your mic? Ah, uh -huh, continue. Teacher, eh, uh, solo eso, solo eso hicimos con, con Don Oscar, solo uno. Ah, uh -huh, no, 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 I said uh, que si podemos apagar el micrófono porque se escucha un poco de interferencia y a Karina y el compañero ah, Edwin. Ajá, uh -huh. porfis, porfis, gracias. Ah, continue. Okay, there are four branches in in San Salvador. That's great. I visited one of the store the other day. Yeah, we we are four in San Salvador. We're planning on launching one on in Sonsonate this day. There isn't one yet. Okay. Okay. Thanks. Okay, very good. Very good. She works for Siman. Para Siman trabaja Karina. Ahora nos dimos cuenta para quién trabaja. Ya ven. <laughs> Pero para las franquicias. Okay, vamos a llegar por ahí. Tal vez nos hacen un descuento. Okay. okay. Eh, Preguntamos por Karina. Uh, <laughs> okay, thank you. Eh, one more participation. Una participación más y nos vamos. ¿Eh? Susi, en lo Ok. Ok. Hello, Susan. Hi, hello. How are you? I'm ok. I get married. Really? When? Where? I married in the last month in the hotel where I work. Seriously? Where do you work? I work in the Crown Plaza. The hotel have uh, many branches in the work. I love my work. There are fantastic rooms and there is a, 
a beautiful decor. There are branches in many countries? Yes, there are 28 hotels. That's good, congratulations. Thank you so much. Okay, very good. Vaya, miren, tenemos buenos conectes acá, ¿verdad? Simán y el, y el, el crown, ¿verdad? <laughs> okay, thank you guys. Uh, I'm going to pass the attendance list, but before I'd like to know if you have any questions. Hay algunas preguntas hasta el momento sobre el there is y el there are? No? No. No, no questions. Please. Okay. So uh, let's see, Alfonso Antonio Cabrera didn't come. Okay, Ana Yancy. Present, Miss. Carmen, Cesar, Heriberto. No. Claudia Lorena. Present, teacher. Danis. Eh, Dolores Saraí. Present. Eduardo. Edwin Daniel. Present teacher. Edwin al final se queda. Eh, Fidel. Present. Flor de María. Eh, Karina Elizabeth. I'm here. Ok. Eh, Lourdes. I'm here, teacher. Luis Armando. Present teacher. Nelson Iván. Present teacher. Eh, Oscar Fernando. Present. Susana Carolina. Ok, so we are going to stop here. Nos vamos a quedar por acá. I'll see you tomorrow and make sure that you answer the homework. Please answer the homework. Ok. Ok, teacher. Ok, I'll see you tomorrow. Have a good night. Teacher. Have a good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Yes, tell me. Ay, señor, tomorrow, eh, ¿cómo, ¿Cómo resultaron los forums? Los forums. Ah, estoy viendo que algunos han comentado, pero a algunos todavía les falta comentar. Uh -huh. Todavía se pueden completar entonces. Sí, todavía se pueden. Ajá, con tal de que no les vaya a fallar ahí la, la, la nota. Ok. Uh -huh. Ok. Bueno, no, yo las completé también. Ok, entonces no hay problema. Uh -huh. Ok, gracias. Ok, good night. See you. Good night. See you. Bye, good night. Bye, bye. Ok, Edwin. Ok, teacher. Ok. Tenemos por acá, Edwin, unos 10 minutitos para sus preguntas, consultas. Pues fíjese que ahorita estaba haciendo la plataforma uh -huh. y le quería preguntar, eh, me ha dado problema una, una pregunta, bueno dos en realidad, uh -huh. del día de ahora, eh, se lo voy a decir, dice, there, bueno la pregunta es, there is three distribution centers in Ilopango, entonces uh -huh. se cambia por there are three Distribution Centers en Ilopango, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Pero le doy y no me sale correcto. No le sale. ¿Puede compartir pantalla? No. Le voy a tomar captura porque no. Voy a cambiar la cámara. Ajá. Uh -huh. Ok. Eh, veamos. There is three Distribution Centers en Ilopango. Ajá. Entonces ah, le he puesto. Okay. There is three, there are, perdón, mm -hmm. distribution center en Ilopango. Mm -hmm. Y el punto. Y me sale mala. Y le sale mala. Mm -hmm. Bueno, déjenme consultar. Debe de haber algún pequeño error ahí. Voy a consultar ah. con los técnicos a ver qué me pueden resolver. Ajá. Y está la otra también. Ajá. La cinco. Que dice, mm -hmm. there are not person to work. Mm -hmm. There is a person to work, le he puesto. Aunque ahí también podría ir como 
one person, ¿verdad? Ajá, one o there is a. Y se la toma mala. Y lleva puntos y todo. Ya probé sin puntos y. No me. No, no agarra. Ok, voy, ah, voy a. Aquí, sorry, pero. Ajá. Aquí dice. There is not. Ajá. Pero ya la había probado y no me. Igual. Ajá. No hay ninguna persona. O oh, podría probar any. There is not. There isn't any, uh, ah, any person. Pruebe con any. Voy a probar primero así. Con, sin contratar. Uh -huh. Y vamos a ver. There isn't. Que uso. Estoy usando el teclado. There isn't. Any person. Uh -huh. No, no agarra. Tu Entonces póngale, there are no people. En vez de person, póngale people, a ver si se lo toma así. Pero there, ajá, are, there are not people. Uh -huh. People to work. Uh -huh. Esa sí la Ahora agarró. Sí se la, eh, eh, vámonos eh. para la de arriba que dice que no le, no le agarraba. Uh -huh. There is there three distribution centers. Yeah. En el Opango. Ajá. Uh -huh. There are three distribution centers en el Opango. Uh -huh. Ahí sí tendría que tomársela como buena porque. Ajá. Uh -huh. uh -huh. No le ha cambiado nada. Sí. Uh -huh. Pero sí, que ajá, hago copiar que... y solo le hago Solo le hago el cambio acá. Uh -huh. Y no sale. No le sale, ajá. Entonces sí, vamos a consultar a ver cuál es el, 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 el detalle ahí, porque sí, there is three distribution centers en el opango. No, y estaba viendo que aquí tengo abierto. Acá está. Ahí mismo está la la respuesta. Ajá, sí, ahí y es la, está. la misma y no me cambió. Ajá. Sí, ahí está. Entonces tiene que ser algún problema con, con la edición. Voy a consultarle a, a los compañeros ahí encargados de, ajá. de los... Ajá, ha de haber algún problemita ahí técnico. Vamos a consultar y bueno, a ver qué nos dicen. Oiga. Ajá. Sí, porque en eso estaba. Uh -huh. Teacher, uh -huh. necesito su ayuda. Claramente. Yo este, he estado practicando. Eh, uh -huh. A mí todavía me falta expresar lo que pienso. Uh -huh. Porque no sé, eh, no sé manejar todavía el but, el because, maybe. Cosas así me cuesta bastante hacer, conjugar bien la, lo que estoy pensando. Uh -huh. Pero he eh, bajado una aplicación que me ha gustado, pero tengo problemas con la pronunciación de ciertas palabras. Uh -huh. okay. Por ejemplo... But con la T, Ajá. TH, que, que es una, un, vo, un vocablo, no, no recuerdo cómo es el nombre, uh -huh. pero que no se maneja en las cuerdas vocales y que no sale aire, sino que tiene que toparse la lengua con los dientes. Para... Uh -huh. el, 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 como el interdental sound. Hay, hay bastante, está el fricative, el africate. Y así, ajá, sí, vale. pero ahí la recomendación sería que, que veamos más videos en inglés, pero con subtítulos, ¿no? para que usted vaya viendo si aparece alguna palabra así con TH, digamos something. Hay personas que dicen something, lo cual es something. incorrecto, ajá. ajá. Sería something, como ya usted lo mencionó, something. es cuando la punta de la lengua topa con eh, los dientes con de los la dientes. parte de arriba, ajá. Something, ajá. ajá. Obstruye el aire, la salida del aire sí. se obstruye. Ajá, entonces sí, sería de ver videos. Eh, de hecho, ahora voy a mandar un video relacionado a la fonética. ¿Qué es eso? La pronunciación. Tal vez le pueda servir. Y también más la, la práctica, ¿verdad? Cuando los envío a los breakup rooms acá, que practiquen, sí. pues tratar de hablar así en inglés para que este, se vaya agarrando más fluidez. Más fluidez. Ajá, sí, porque eso es lo que... que es. Sí. A pesar de que al inicio lo haga un poco lento, pues ya poco a poco va a agarrar este, la, la fluidez que necesita, pero sí, necesitaríamos trabajar de lleno, ¿verdad? La, 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 solo en inglés, en inglés, en inglés, en inglés. 
yo sí. <risa> me cuesta, crea lo que me cuesta. Ajá, sí, yo sé que cuesta, pero ajá, hay, que, hay que intentarlo. ¿no? Sí, ajá. Ah, sí, yo sé, sí. Pero no con, las, sí. con las temáticas de la clase la ha sentido fácil hasta el momento, vamos despacio. No, yo la siento, es como, bueno, como en cada, creo que en cada módulo hemos visto el de ir, de dar, y hay cosas que sí me han ido cambiando, por eso, por ejemplo. Esa que le pregunté ahora, la de Polit, uh -huh. Pollution, Pollution. Perdón. Pollution, esa se la hice al teacher anterior, pero me hizo mención, porque antes yo lo usaba con Lorov, pero uh -huh. eh, me dice, no, eso es incorrecto, me uh -huh. tendría que ser de is porque es un contable, y entonces comenzó con la clase de un contable, pero uh -huh. había quedado con ciertas duda, dudas, uh -huh. pero sí, ahora lo, con lo, 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 ya lo. me aclaró. Ajá, puede usarlo con el so much, es, es lo más, o sea, todos los concepts, so la, la mayoría es con much, so much, a little so bit, much. poco, ajá, porque, o sea, ah. no puede decir usted, hay dos contaminaciones, hay tres contaminaciones, no es contable, pues. No, ajá, es contable. Ajá. Sí, entonces tenía esa duda, entonces hay cosas que, que cada vez voy aprendiendo más, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Crea lo que voy aprendiendo, porque uh -huh. son buenos, todos los profesores que he tenido son son excelentes, creo uh -huh. lo que de todos he aprendido así un poco de cada uno no, bastante uh -huh. hago así porque mi recepción todavía es demasiado pequeña verdad ah, aunque uh -huh. intento pero es poca todavía ajá, uh -huh. ok uh -huh. alguna sí. otra sí, pero la práctica la práctica hacia el maestro dicen, ¿verdad? entonces así <risa> es que ah, es, de, es de meterle bastante este, así, por medio de la música también, si se escucha música en inglés puede ver la letra y todo eso ah, eso es otro no sé si usted tendrá bueno, como ustedes manejan bastante información de videos y todo eso uh -huh. este, algo que ayude a uno a recordar más las cosas Uh -huh. eh, con respecto a, a la música a, al vocabulario a, a mí, antes me las podía hoy se me olvidan, hay días que se me olvidan hay días que uh -huh. recuerdo que quizás hablo un poco más fluido y hay días que hablo menos que ando uh -huh. como apagado uh -huh. a veces creo que es por el, el de velo porque hay días que estoy bien adormitado y me meto y por eso mejor ni hablo porque hasta las ideas se me han ido me <risa> ok no, Ajá. este, vaya ahí en todo caso, Edwin, sí, sería de practice, practice, la práctica nomás, so, ahí la practice. práctica, Ajá. es de intentar, yo sé que cuesta, porque decimos, bueno, ¿y cómo voy a hablar? O sea, quiero hablar rápido, o sea, queremos correr antes de caminar, me explico. Entonces, sí. pero lo ideal es paso a paso, despacio, con paciencia y perseverancia, todo, todo se logra, no, no se trata de que ay, no, solo porque no hablo el primer día, pues ya, ya no me voy a conectar, no no, no, no he tirado la toalla todavía <risa> quiero no ha llegado, ese es mi meta. No, no ha llegado donde asustan todavía, dice no, no. quiero graduarme, es mi meta ah, sí, de, de sí. hecho de eso se trata, pues, o sea, eh, tratar ¿verdad? ahí de, de estar siempre apoyándoles en lo que se puede, como les repito, yo envío siempre los videos ahí para que los vean, pues y si usted puede y, y tiene tiempo o alguien más para practicar o mandar mensajes al grupo, yo creo que los compañeros contestarían. Uh -huh. Ajá. Sí, sí. sí. Uh -huh. Ahí es la, la falta, la, la falta de tiempo es también lo que le afecta a uno, ¿verdad? Pero sí, uh -huh. este, con los videos me pongo a escucharlo nada más. A veces uh -huh. no, no veo la, la expresión de la cara ni nada, solo los escucho. Uh -huh. Los pongo audífonos y así, igual que la, la música, para entender un poquito más la... Porque eso también, cuando a veces están hablando y hablan un poquito más rápido, uh -huh. dejo de entender las ah, cosas. Ah, ok. Ah, entonces, pero uh -huh. intento, hago una, una unión de cosas con, con otras y ya. Ajá. Uh -huh. Ya me sale un poquito. Ajá. Uh -huh. Ok, pues Edwin. Entonces, no sé si tendrá alguna otra consulta. No, teacher. Solamente. No. Ok, uh -huh. pues. Lo veo mañana y espero pues que sí se pueda graduar. Oiga. Ya va a ver que sí. Ahí va a salir okay. en, la, en la página. Ok. Thank you, Edwin. Good night, teacher. Good night.